What is going on guys? It is Fady. So we are back with this week's 100 plus. Uh, we're going to be focusing more so on what I believe is to be the most underused weapon or class in the game. So I believe I finished off this game on 133 kills to 9 deaths. These are the games I like to see. I like to upload it for you guys. Lots of kills. Nice high KD. So I'm going to keep it up with the gameplay. Well we're going to be not be focusing more so on the gameplay. We're going to be looking more towards the actual class itself. Because this class I'm about to tell you guys about. One, I never see it being used too much, especially the gun. And two, it's honestly equivalent to my VMP class. So I, I know a lot of you guys know me, and all I use is the VMP. I think I have something like 56,000 kills with just the VMP alone. And that's basically what I I've always said is my best class, the best class in the game. But I'm not too sure that this class right here may actually beat it. Because sometimes I choose this class over my VMP. But uh, let's get right into the class so I can let you guys use it for you guys self as well. So first of all, most underused weapon. Well not the most, one of the most underused weapon. The Weevil. So this gun is an absolute tearing machine. It's just you have to have the right attachments on it. So for the right attachments and what I was using and seemed to be working was Grip, Fast Mag, the standard attachments I usually run on my submachine guns. But then the last third attachment is a little bit different. It's and that is rapid fire. On the Weevil, you guys literally absolutely need rapid fire. It's still a great gun without rapid fire. It's just if you put rapid fire on, it doesn't it doesn't uh, add too much recoil to the gun at all. It's still very handling. You can still handle it real nicely, and it just makes the gun two times better. It just slays two times faster. So those are the attachments you guys need to use on the gun. So now for the perks I use. Perk 1, it's pretty obvious I use it on basically every class in the game and that's Afterburner. Just because this game's all about speed, I say it to my friends all the time, it's all about speed. You can't play slow, it's not COD 4, it's not Modern Warfare 3, Ghost. Times have changed, you gotta start moving, put on Afterburner. Now, perk 2 is you wanna use fast hands. So for me, fast hands makes it so you can shoot faster. And it's kind of just a thing I really, really prefer, and it helps me win a lot more gunfights, and I just highly recommend it for you guys. So, fast hands. Now, I have a second perk too, and that's Scavenger. You guys, Scavenger is highly needed in this game, just because how fast Black Ops 3 is, you can be burning through lots of ammo. You need to be able to pick up some ammo, and not have to pick up some random guns. And now, for perk 3, I use Tactical Mask. So... Tactical Mask isn't really needed, unless if you're playing Nuketown. Nuketown is highly just crazy with stuns and grenades and whatnot like that. So you guys have to throw in Tactical Mask. That just makes it so you don't get stunned mid-game or anything like that. A perk you guys can switch it out with if you guys aren't running Nuketown and you guys are just going to be doing the normal maps. I highly recommend, Bra Blast highly recommend Blast Suppressor. That makes it so, you know all the sliding and jumping you do in Black Ops 3? Well, every time you do that, you go onto the radar. So, if you put Blast Suppressor on, that just completely hides you from all the enemies. And now, score streaks. Just a little quick tip, if you guys are as well trying for 100 plus. Uh, one of my most recommended score streaks are Hardened Sentry, and then Wraith, and then Raps. So these three score streaks, if you can get them all in a really low time and just have be able to send them all, send them out all at once, I guarantee they will get you a crazy amount of kills. And I get a messages from you guys saying a lot of times, Fady, you get your 100 pluses by using lethal kill streaks. Yes, I do use lethal kill streaks, but the reason being is because a lot of my 100 pluses like you guys are seeing is me running around solo. A lot of other guys, you guys run in six mans. So don't be giving me all this stuff saying, oh, I use lethal kill streaks. You run six mans and get your 100 pluses. I play solo and get mine. So I'm just going to correct myself real quick. I was playing with one other person or two. One other person, but it wasn't like we were using crazy stuff like to help me or whatever. So, but there it is, guys. 133 to 9. I hope you guys all enjoyed. I am out. Peace, guys. See you in the next one.